There is a new comedy from England called Wicked Little Letters. And here's Terry's take. Wicked Little Letters gets a huge lift from the fine comic performances of Oscar-winning actress Olivia Colman and Oscar-nominated actress Jessie Buckley. The two play next-door neighbors in a small English town just after the First World War, when one of them starts getting anonymous letters full of profanity-laced insults. When the wrong person is accused of this offense, chaos ensues. Wicked Little Letters is a lightweight comedy that pokes good fun at the foolishness of men who try to control women. The recipient of the obscene letters is Olivia Coleman as Edith Swan, a spinster in her late 40s who still lives with her parents. Holy heavens. Carry on. Dear Edith, you foxy ass old whore. In the end, I think it's just jealousy. I think we know who it is. Love our neighbor and I tried, but... The prime suspect She's lives famous. next door. Jessie just... Buckley plays Rose Gooding, a free-spirited young woman with a young daughter. I can't see why they think it's me. I was a bit roisterous once or twice. What's the evidence? Larry, you There is no real evidence, but Rose is arrested. Her only ally in the police department is the only woman who works there. I believe you may be charging an innocent. If you meddle in my case, these will be on your wrists. But that doesn't stop the female cop from investigating on her own. When Rose gets out on bail before her trial, the sanctimonious Edith confronts her. I forgive you, Rose. Edith, I didn't do it. I'm not actually evil, you know. No, but you've got evil in you. No, no, it's not your fault. You were born with it, but I like you, Rose, and, and I'd like to bring you to the light. About halfway through the film, we find out who the real culprit is, but not before all of England learns about the scandal. The mystery of the obscene little Hampton letters is causing widespread distress across the nation. Loosely based on a true story, Wicked Little Letters is a delicious little treat. Terry Hunter, Hawaii News Now.